Hi everybody, welcome in. If this is your first video with me, welcome back if it is not. Either way, I am so excited that you're here and super grateful you've decided to spend just a little bit of your day with me today. So today we're gonna open some classic villains bag clips. This is a brand new set that was just released and I'm very excited. So if you wanna open these bag clips, let's just get started, shall we? I'm Rachel and this is Attainable Disney. This is a set, this is like a brand new set that was just released uh, where we've got just like assorted villains, right? So not like a particular film or franchise, or whatever, but just like assorted villains. Um, and what I think is cool is that like most of these characters have bag clips, right? But we're just doing like a new version. So I, lo I like this. Normally I'm a big fan of the like single franchise or like single movie ones, but these are cool, right? I mean, I like... I like the villain, so this is really fun. They did like a villain set before, but obviously now they're like super hard to find um, and very expensive, so this is great. So for these ones, I have six because I pre-ordered these from Entertainment Earth, which like I don't normally do. Like I normally just get them from like Box Lunch or Hot Topic or whatever, but I pre-ordered these a while ago, so I have six because that's how they, you can either buy six or you can buy the whole box. Let's see what we can do. Ready? One, two. Ooh. Mother Gothel. Look at that face. Ooh, she's looking angry. Two. One, two. Ooh, Scar. Why is he smiling? Oh my God, that's so funny. Cute. Ready? One, two. Oh, oh my God, look at that. Lady Tremaine with Lucifer. <gasps> oh my gosh. I love that. The detail of the little cat is like a lot. I love that. However, her face is like all just painted on, which I don't love, right? Like if you look at like this, like this one, her eyes are, are sculpted and carved. Her mouth is painted, which I don't love, but at least half her face is carved. This one, her whole face is just painted. Oh, now this package is very, look how this is very thin. I'm going to guess that this is a Yizma. Just based off that. One, two. Yeah. Just because, like, I could just tell from the package that she was just like a skinny little, little thing. Um, How funny is this, though? Interesting again, um, her eyes are carved. The smile is painted. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Um, number five, another skinny one. One, two, yeah. Okay. So another Peter. And then now number six, the last one is quite bulky. So this one's going to be different. One, two. Okay, and another repeat. All right, well, I have filmed a number of bag club openings today, and this was the crappiest one. So let's review I got, so we got a Gothel, a Lady Tremaine, two Yizmas, and two Scars. So I have to say that, like, I feel unimpressed. So, like, remember, okay, so, like, 
Gothel's got that red, that curly hair. Remember when we opened the Merida ones and all those individual curls were carved? Like, what is this? What is this? The painted face is not doing it for me. Yeah, the painted, like the big painted mouth. I mean, the scar one, I really, I honestly have no complaints about the scar one other than I just didn't want to. But like, what are you going to do about that? Like, I'm wor what I worry about with the paint is that the paint is going to wear off. Where if it's carved, it, it won't, it's not going to wear off um, in the same way, I guess. So, I don't know. I just, I think something I, I constantly talk about with these keychains is the attention to detail. Um, and the detail that's in them and how much like I love that and I appreciate that. So, then when you see ones that don't have it, I feel like it stands out so much more. Uh, you guys may remember those, like, sea friends, those, like, I don't know if it was Nemo or it was just, like, ocean character ones that I opened that were awful, um, like, that were similar, like, had painted faces and there was no, no detail, like, carved, right? I don't know. I don't, I feel like it just stands out. They, like, set themselves up for failure. You can't put this out, right? And then put this out for the same price <laughs> you know what I'm saying like you can't call those the same thing sorry not sorry a little bit bummed that I didn't get really any of my like hardcore favorites like Evil Queen or Ursula Hades Maleficent anything like that but I also don't really see myself buying more of these just because like these ones were not good I don't love these I don't love this set. Um, but I don't know. That's my take on it. I may like trade for other ones. Like if I can see what other people got. I can see like a picture. Like that might. You know I don't know. If I could see a photograph. That might increase my confidence. But I don't know. You know I mean you guys know. I just like love these keychains so much. And like I have so many of them and I open so many of them that like I just I do I have high standards I, I do but like they also meet those standards so often and so that's why I feel like when they don't that's why it just like is so obvious and like kind of falls so short is that it's like what the like what what is this what is this so no so that's my take let me know your thoughts very anxious to hear um and if you want any of my uh doubles I'll have them in the group, so uh, linked below. So I'll see you guys there, okay? All right, bye.